This is the brutal logic that allows a species to endure. To understand why this brutal survival trait is so critical, you need to understand that we are talking about two entirely different worlds. It's a tale of two quokas. The first world is Rottnest Ireland. On paper, it's part of Australia, but in reality, it's a kind of ecological time capsule. Separated from the mainland over 7,000 years ago by rising sea levels, it was isolated from the predators that would later dominate the continent. There are no foxes, no dingoes, no feral cats. For a quokka, it's a paradise. Then, there is the second world, the mainland. This is the quokka's ancestral home, and today, it is a battlefield. Here, they face a constant threat from introduced predators that their species never evolved to handle. Their populations are fragmented, vulnerable, and listed as a protected species. The Joey Drop isn't some abstract theory